Make sure to use code UNICORN whenever you're buying Robux or Premium. Hey y'all and welcome back to the channel. I'm Sonny. Welcome back. Make sure you leave a like down below. Subscribe for new internet notifications so you guys never miss a video. But today I decided to decorate for Halloween. Yeah, it's not <laughs> September yet, but you know what? It's fine. Earlier the better. But then I realized I don't actually have a house. So we have to pick a house from the list. You know what? I'm just going to go for the summer cottage house and then we can rename it to like the fall cottage house or whatever. So um, yeah, we're going to decorate for Halloween. Let me know down in the comments below if you guys have already decorated for Halloween or fall or whatever in Bloxburg because I would love to know. Like, am I too early on this? I don't think I'm too early, guys. I think this is the perfect time to start. So, if you haven't already done so, you should totally go decorate. But first things first, let's go ahead and recolor this. It's green right now, so you know what? We're just gonna make it orange because... Why not? Oh, should I make it like this lighter orange so it's not like very... Yeah, I think that's a lot better because the other one's way too orange. And it... yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna go with this nougat color. Okay, so the outside is all painted. So let's go ahead and go inside. Um, We have a couple of pink things here. I'm not sure why. Oh, wait, I think I made them pink for a thumbnail and I forgot to change it back. But for the inside, we're gonna make some things orange as well. Um, But I wanna add some black stuff as well. So maybe we should make this stuff into black. I think that's a little too black or we can mix it up and add orange and black So I think that looks a lot better So we're just gonna change all of these little things that I have into this color um, And hopefully it looks good so far. It doesn't look that shabby not gonna lie um, So there we go and then I'm actually gonna delete this stuff over here because we're gonna add some Halloween decor on this corner instead and I almost forgot to change the color of the kitchen So let me go ahead and change this over here uh, To the nougat color also this door as well uh, So let's go ahead and do that and also the room. I just noticed how this whole house is very green So we're just gonna change it to orange and it'll be great And then for these picture frames, I think I'm gonna do a couple black ones here. Maybe an orange one also there is purple sometimes in halloween so i'm gonna add uh, a couple purple ones and then another orange one so i think that's a nice little array of them i also forgot to change this so let's go ahead and change that and now that we've changed all the colors it is time to bring out the decorations that i'm super excited for so let's head on into my inventory and i have a lot of stuff guys like i have almost 200 pumpkins i don't know why but i just do so um we're gonna add a couple over here maybe one on uh, this little shelf thing that I have that I have no decorations on so let's do that and maybe we can add uh, one of these tall ones over here. You know what? I There's table ones. I don't know why I'm putting these giant ones on the table, but it's fine. We have the miniature pumpkins for that. So let's go ahead and add like a couple of miniature pumpkins on that table. And then we also have some jack-o'-lanterns. So we're going to keep a couple outside. So we have that really cute. Um, and while we're out here, maybe we should add some... Oh, you know what? Actually, I'm going to add the ghost inside. So it looks like it's like, you know, looking outside. Oh, yeah, I like that a lot better. Okay, so that's perfect right there. And then let's see what else we have. We do have some hanging ghosts and hanging things. So maybe I should hang one mm, right here, maybe. And then, of course, we have the giant spiders. And last time I added them onto my roof. So I have to add a couple on my roof. And then we'll also go ahead and add um, one inside. I don't think I have enough room inside. So maybe we'll skip on that. Um, let's see what else we can add. We do have some coffins. Maybe add a coffin on the side over here with, um, a skeleton. We also need some trees because it looks just so bare outside. So maybe we can add some of these trees. Make it a little bit more spooky. Okay, not too shabby so far. And let's go back into our inventory over here and see what else we can find. Where are my giant skeletons? Ah, there they are. Okay, these aren't giant skeletons, but we're gonna we're gonna put a couple outside over here. Also, this pumpkin is not where I need it to be. Okay, there we go. And then we also have the giant skeleton, so maybe we should add one right here and then we also have a window decal so i'm just gonna add a window decal to this window here and then also this window since the ghost isn't on this door um not door this window and then we also need something for this corner since i don't have anything uh, maybe i can just add like this happy pu the pumpkin happy pumpkin thing my bobber um and then maybe a sinister one as well beautiful and then 
Something in the middle, huh? We also, let's go ahead and put this outside. I just noticed how many Halloween decorations I have. Like this house is way too small for all the decorations I have in my inventory. So I'm trying my best. Let's go ahead and add some cobwebs as well with some spiders. Um, so let's add one there, maybe one in this corner as well. And of course we have to add some ghost switches to the roof possibly. There we go, yes, that's perfect. Okay, so we have that and then I still need to find things to put in um, this corner. It's a little empty still, so... Hmm, what else can we add? Also, I'm gonna go ahead and add a candy bowl, um, over here. And then we- oh, a candy cauldron! Oh, I gotta have a candy cauldron there, I guess. I mean, it's a little small, but, I mean, it works. Um, we also have stacked pumpkins that I totally forgot about. These are some cute decorations, so, um, let's add them to here and here. And then maybe we can add some in the bedroom as well. Maybe in this corner, yeah. These are actually really cute. I actually really like these, so um, we'll add some over there as well. And I almost forgot about the spooky bushes. We have to add some of these, so we're just gonna add um, them to the doors. I think they all look really cute, so there we go. And then we also have some string lights. I don't want to put them inside because the color is kind of ugly uh, when I put them inside, so I'm just gonna put them outside here. Looking pretty cute. Um, also, it's just really bothering me how, like, this orange nougat color looks like the brown, so it's very ugly, but you know what? It's fine. We're gonna keep it. And then we need a little pavement sort of thing, like, coming from it, from, like, the door, so maybe we should add some dirt piles for that, you know? Yeah, I think that looks that looks nice. It doesn't look nice, but it looks okay. So, um, there we go. I feel like I have a lot more decorations in my inventory than I can actually fit in this cottage house. Um, but here is just a mini tour of our new, uh house i mean this isn't really the house that i use but i just really wanted to decorate something for halloween so uh we have a couple of decorations outside we have our inflatable jack-o-lantern some skeletons pumpkins and all that and then we go inside we have um some spider webs and just a lot of decor we got pumpkins um and yeah looking pretty nice maybe we should change these pictures over here to be honest yeah let's go ahead and do that so if i type in halloween let's see what pops up Ooh, that's a cute little one. Yeah, we can do that one. And then we can do a nice little pumpkin. Why not? This one says meet me at the pumpkin patch, but you know what? We're, I'm just gonna use it because it looks cute. And then maybe we should add like a witch one because why not? I don't know if there is a good witch one. Um, I don't really like any of these, not gonna lie. So let me just type in happy Halloween and something will pop up hopefully. Oh, this one's kind of cute, but it says some, okay. Let's just go ahead and use that. And then I went ahead and added another pumpkin picture and then also this cute little one over here. So yeah, there we go. There we have it. I have decorated our little cottage uh, for Halloween here. Let me go ahead and rename this as well. And let's name it the Halloween Cottage. I think that's a better name for it now. So um, there we have it. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video of watching me decorate a little bit too early for Halloween, but if you guys have decorated yourselves, let me know down in the comments below. And also, if you guys have any pictures or anything like that, make sure to tweet them at me on Twitter, or you can put them in my Discord server. All the links are down in the description below, because I would love to see y'all's um, Halloween decorations a little bit early. But you know what? It's never too early. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, leave a like down below, subscribe if you're new, and turn that notification bell so you guys don't miss a video, and I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.